Good morning, everyone in YouTube land. Jacefer here, and it is early morning brick sorting time. Yep, except I'm not sorting just any brick. I am going through roof tiles. You can see I'm sorting through various types and sizes. And basically what I'm doing, I'm going through one of my Sterilite containers because this drawer can no longer close. That's bad. So I'm dividing things up into three categories. Uh, I have just basically random colors here of various sizes. Here I'm putting the 20 degree slope and then this far right, the 45 degree slope. And just to give an example, oh, another box of Lego fell over. I have another container here, and I'll show you. These are 20 degree slope dark red. Yes, that's a lot of brick in there. So, and I'll tell you, it's really convenient, especially when you're trying to find roof tiles. So basically, right now, I'm just sorting through brick. Get that knob out of the way, because I'm hitting it. Um, there we go. I'm not sorting by type yet, but I am sorting by color in this instant. Uh, you're probably thinking, well, you kind of shift gears here, Jay. You, you were sorting by type, now you're sorting by color. I consider these type of roof a roof system, just as if these. These are different, these are roof systems. I like to keep them packaged up so if I need to build a house with, let's say, 45 degree slope, I can find these. I don't have a lot of blue. Matter of fact, this is the only blue outside corner I have, so it wouldn't make any sense to build a house with, with a blue roof, because I don't have a lot of them. But as you can see here, I already pulled out a handful of roof tiles, um, except for the 45 double corner. I have plenty of double corners. So I'm dividing them up so I can package each roof system. I think that's going to be more efficient. And some of you guys have pointed out in a previous video that I had made a mistake in sorting some parts. Uh, like I have said before, you are never going to go through this the first time around. Um, I've been having bad luck trying to find sterilites, but once I find them, I can get rid of the Tupperware and, of course, put them in actual drawers. So it's better to start now than later. All I got to do is just dump this in. So pretty much things are going well. You can see that I've got a lot of these. Um, so, you know, I'll mix, I may mix them up from time to time, like this container here, it's going to be hard to show, but it's a little over half full. I really like the, uh, fact that I can pull out dark red anytime I need to. Um, I get, still getting questions asked about a collection video. You guys and gals have to be patient. I'd like to go through this. I don't want to stop and have to drag everything out to make a collection video. It may happen, but right now I like to get bricks sorted. It'd be better to build the house or something than just trying to go through and... Because imagine going through here. If I needed maybe a 45 uh, inside corner, they're going to be hard to find. I don't want to have to dig through all these other pieces, you know, to find them. I'm pulling out a lot of 20s. But you can see that once I pull them out, you get a full entire complete roof system. So, I've seen some of you guys and gals sort your roof pieces out by uh, slope size. Now this bin here has got basically 45s, 20s, I think some really those real steep ones that are like 1x2x3, you know, those style of roof pieces. 
if one of these colors happens to dominate, and I have a feeling black may dominate, I might pull them out. But for roof pieces, for me, I like to categorize them by type. Like, okay, these are 20 degree, regular sloped. I like to keep those packaged up. And the 45s. But it's all about a preference, so if you can do it any way you wish. And yeah, so sorting continues. Not really much of a vlog today, just wanted to point that out. And I've seen some of you guys and gals sorting techniques, and you guys say that you sort things by color. This is an exception. I could mix these up with the, um, you know, the dark red, and of course you got uh, magenta, which that wouldn't look too good in there. I could do that, but if I want to build a red roof, I don't want to hunt through 20 purples or such to find a piece. Instead, I'd rather go through a roof theme, like the 20 degree bin and the 45. Of course, these are bright red. So, it'd be a lot more convenient to go through that. I know some of you guys have the dark blue roof tiles. I don't have a lot of those. I'm planning on building those up next. I'd like to have a variety of different colors. I want to start building a couple of houses, like a neighborhood. I think it'd be cool to build several houses at one time. But as you can tell, I'm not really in a short of roof pieces, but I don't want to use like, I have 10 houses on my neighborhood. I don't want them all to have bright red roofs. I don't want the roofs to be the same pitch. Now the pitch of these is 20, pitch of these is 45, so it's, it's, it'll be boring. I don't want to do that. So I'm trying to spice it up a bit. So yeah, I'll go ahead and wrap this video up, but that's pretty much how I'm sorting out the Lego bricks for the slopes, and in this case, it's about style and color. I like to keep them packaged up in a bundle, and just like this container here, and I'll give you a quick tour of what I have in here, let's say I'm building a house. I want to take a look and see what kind of roof tiles I have. I have some 3x3s, 3x4s, I have a 3x3 inside corner, there's a 2x3, a 3x3 outside corner, I have some 1x3s buried in here somewhere, and the thing is, and how you know you need to order more parts, obviously, if you don't have a certain size and it's hard to find, yeah, it's pretty full. And I'm, st and I'm still waiting for a few more roof tiles, so this thing will be really well topped off. I am going to order possibly, you know, a couple more of these inside corners, maybe a few of these. Although these come in a lot of sets, and the outside corners. Maybe a few of those 3 by 3s but I'll tell you, this is convenient. I can grab a tile out of here. Okay, I need 10 of these, so I can grab one, two, three, and not have to, because honestly, if they are in this, I'd have to go through here and literally fish out the color and the style. So, anyways, I will wrap this video up. And that's how I'm sorting out roof tiles. And if this bin starts overflowing, I will decompose this even further. So anyways, this is a good tidbit. Package your roof elements up in themes. This is a 20, or I should say pitches. This is the 20 degree pitch style roof and a 45 degree pitch. And of course, they're both bright red. 
because there's not a lot of roof tiles in different colors. So I'll leave that up with you guys and gals, and I want to ask a question is, how do you sort your roof tiles? Do you sort them by, do you sort them by pitch? Do you sort them by color or style? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Also, take a poke at jacefer.com because I'm going to be streaming live shows on there and testing out the chat room. Thank you guys and gals for taking the time to watch this video.